For these people, turning 60 is just halfway through their lives. Meet them in this. Top 10 Oldest Women in the World Number 10. Bessie Hendricks Bessie Sharkey, this was her maiden name, was born on November 7, 1907 in Carroll County, Iowa, 114 years ago. She's the oldest living person residing in the United States. Her father was an Irish immigrant, and she was the fifth of six siblings. The year after her birth, the family moved to a farm near Lake City, Iowa. Bessie attended the Lake City School because the rural school had closed. In 1921, when she was 13 years old, her mother died, and she had to take on doing a lot of chores. Nevertheless, she continued her education and managed to graduate in 1926. She even began teaching at a rural school. In 1930, she married Paul Hendricks, moved in with him on his farm, and had five children. Three of them are still alive. Currently, she has nine grandchildren, 28 great-grandchildren, 42 great-great-grandchildren, and seven quad-grandchildren. Number 9. Sofia Rojas Sofia Rojas was born on August 13, 1907, on a small farm in the department of Santander, Colombia. To date, she's none other than 114 years old. Sofia had four children, and all her life worked selling guarapo which is a drink made from sugarcane. In 1947, when she was 50 years old, she moved to Bacara Manga. Her neighbors know her as the Dove, and it's known that she's quite attached to Catholicism and devoted to the Virgin of Candelaria. On May 21, 2021, she became the oldest person in Colombia after the death of Juana Aritama, who was 113 years and 331 days old. Currently, Sofia has 18 grandchildren, 24 great-grandchildren, and 16 great-great-grandchildren. Even her younger sister is still alive and is 97 years old. Number 8. Anonymous Woman from Hyogo By far, this is the most mysterious number on the entire top 10 list. This is a woman who remains anonymous, but her date of birth and, therefore age, have been confirmed by the Gerontology Research Group and the Ministry of Health, Labor, and Welfare of Japan. She was born on April 29, 1907, so she was 114 years old when I was making this video. It's known that she lives in the Japanese city of Miki, in the prefecture of Hyogo in Japan. On May 23, 2021, she became the oldest living person in her prefecture after Hama Yusakawa died when she was 14 years and 124 days old. Number 7. Fusa Tatsumi Japan is known for having long-lived inhabitants, and Fusa Tatsumi is an example of it. She was born on April 25, 1907, and is 114 years old. She became the oldest person in Osaka Prefecture after Katsuko Nakajimi died in February 2020. She's also the second oldest person in Japan. Number 6. Casilda Benegas We go back to South America to meet Casilda Benegas, who was born in the department of Itapua, Paraguay, on April 8, 1907, and is 114 years old. In 1945, at the age of almost 38, she emigrated to Buenos Aires, the capital of Argentina. And in 2000, at the age of 93, she emigrated to Spain, but went back 13 years later. Due to all this, she's one of the world's longest living migrants. In December 2020, she got COVID-19, but experienced almost no symptoms and eventually got better, showing her good health condition. This event made her the third oldest woman to have recovered from this disease. Following the death of Antonia de Santa Cruz on January 23, 2022, Casilda became the oldest living woman in South America. Currently, she lives in a nursing home, and according to the nurses, she has a good appetite and even swears in Guarani, which is a native language, when she gets angry. Number 5. Maria Brañas Morera this Spanish woman of American origin is the oldest living person in Spain and the oldest living person born in the United States. She was born on March 4, 1907 in San Francisco, United States, and is currently 115 years old. Her parents had settled in her hometown a year before her birth, and in 1915, they decided to emigrate to Catalonia, Spain. During her voyage aboard the ship Catalania, Maria injured her eardrum in an accident, causing her to lose hearing in one ear. 
At the end of the voyage, Joseph Branias, Maria's father, died of tuberculosis and his body was thrown into the sea. His wife was left alone to care for five children. Maria grew up in Spain and married in 1931. In 2000, when she was already 93 years old, she moved to a nursing home in the Spanish city of Olat. According to witnesses, she was still reading newspapers every day at the age of 110. She has three children, and until 2019, she had 11 grandchildren and 11 great-grandchildren. In April 2020, she became the oldest person to catch and recover from COVID-19. However, in January 2021, an older woman beat this disease and stole her thunder. You'll find out who it was later on. Number 4. Tekla Junowitz Tekla Dadak, as her maiden name was, is a Pole who was born on June 10, 1908 in Krupsko. Back then, this city was part of the Austro-Hungarian Empire, which became part of Poland after World War I, and it's currently in Ukraine. Tekla is 115 years old and is the only person alive since 1906. Her mother died during World War I, and her father sent her to a school where she learned to sew, embroider, and cook. When she was 20 years old, she married John Junowitz, who was 22 years older than her, and they had two daughters together. After surviving World War II, the family moved to the Polish city of Gliwice, where her husband got a job in a mine. In 1980, she became a widow, and her husband was 96 years old when he died. Tekla lived alone until the age of 103, when her grandson Adam moved in to help her. To this day, she's the oldest person in Poland. Number 3. Maria Kanonowicz Maria Kanonovich was born on May 27, 1904 and is 117 years old. She lives in her native Belarus and is one of the very few old women who hasn't been confirmed in the gerontological research group yet. However, her date of birth is listed on her passport. Despite getting on in years, she's still active, does small activities at home, and occasionally receives journalists who want to know more about her life. She enjoys gardening, and up to a few years ago, she kept bees and extracted their honey by simply pressing the combs on a cheesecloth. Number 2. Lucille Randon Lucille Randon was born on February 11, 1904, and is currently 118 years old. She's the oldest woman in Europe. She was born in Alès, in the Occitanie region of southern France, and had a twin, but her sister died at the age of 18 months. At a later time, she said God was making her live the years that her twin hadn't been able to enjoy. She was 14 years old at the end of World War I, and she claims to happily recall the day her two brothers came from the battlefield. Although she was born into a Protestant family and had a grandfather who was a pastor, she converted to Catholicism at the age of 27 and became a follower at the age of 40, being consecrated as Sister Andre in honor of her older brother. Lucille worked as a governess for several families, including the wealthy Peugeot family owners of car factories. She spent 28 years caring for sick people and 30 years caring for elderly people. At the age of 91, she had a heart attack that forced her to undergo carotid artery surgery. And in 2019, at the age of 114, she moved to a retirement home in Toulon, France. There she contracted COVID-19, which affected more than half of the residents. After healing, she became the world's longest living COVID survivor. Bonus! Before knowing the first place, I want to tell you about some women who were even older than many in this video, but they already rest in peace. Among them is Jean Calment, a French woman known for being the oldest registered woman in history. She was born on February 21, 1875 and just died on August 4, 1997. So she was about 122 years and 64 days old. Jean was already 40 years old in World War I. Another long-lived woman was the American Sarah Knaus, who was born on September 24, 1888 and died on December 30, 1999, aging 119 years and 125 days. Oh my god! And there are two more who aren't even officially recognized. There's Chinese Alemihan Sayeti, who was born on June 25, 1886 and died on December 17, 2021. So she was 135 years and 175 days old. 
and Seker Arslan, a Turkish woman whose ID indicates that she was born on June 27, 1902. Seker died on February 11, 2022, at the age of 119 years and 229 days. All right, now it's time to meet the oldest woman who was still alive and kicking. Number 1. Kane Tanaka the oldest living woman in the world was born prematurely on January 2, 1903, in the Fukuoka Prefecture in Japan. She's currently 119 years old and, as she confesses, her goal is to reach age 120. In 1922, at the age of 17, she married her husband Hideo Tanaka. The couple had five children and one of them was adopted. Her husband and son went to fight China in the war that began in 1937. During World War II, Hideo Tanaka worked in her family's store, selling rice cakes and noodles, and at the end of the war, she converted to Christianity under the influence of pastors who arrived with the American army after the defeat of Japan. She continued to work at the store until she retired at the age of 63, and in the 1990s, her husband died after 71 years of marriage. Hideo Tanaka went through a lot. At the age of 90, she had cataract surgery and, years later, at the age of 103, she had colon surgery. Currently, she has five grandchildren and eight great-grandchildren and lives in a nursing home. For Tokyo 2020, she was going to take part in the Olympic torch relay, but this initiative was scrapped due to the pandemic. These were the oldest women in the world. We have much more content for you, so subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications. See you in the next video.